Qatar is a very small country and it's a, it's a very small market. And uh, Qatar, uh, because of its uh, very harsh environment, has been importing nearly 9% of its food. Uh, this has put Qatar in a very dangerous position. And when the 2008 crisis happened, uh, Qatar faced some major issues. Uh, because countries, other countries, looked after their interests and protection, so they were limiting exports. Therefore, suddenly, we were not getting any produce that we needed, some of them. And, uh, and so on some of these, uh, the prices just skyrocketed. And uh, Qatar looked and saw what other countries were doing, basically trying to uh, secure some kinds of food from abroad by investing on land. But uh, Qatar, within a very short period of time, realized that this is not really securing food because when you import, you are set insecure. It's a basic understanding of the sentence. So Qatar has started the National Food Program for Food Security, uh, where basically it's looking for it to be self-sufficient as much as possible by implementing or using new technologies. And that's what we're doing. The meetings uh, have uh, made us uh, realize that, uh, you know, that we have to work together, uh, that we have to share knowledge. And uh, we, I'll be honest with you, we understood this, uh, uh, this important um, uh, meaning very early on because uh, our emir has had the understanding that whatever we develop in Qatar, we need to develop with other people. And therefore, we should also share it with other people. And that's why, very early on, the GDLA initiative, which is a Global Thailand Alliance, where other countries in a similar situation, but having also good financial background so they can solve the problems, can come together to help each other, and by helping each other, they will help other countries that are not so well to do. So, for instance, for Qatar, we have a large foreign aid. We will use that to use that technology that we have to bring it to other countries. So, uh, in the Emir's speech, in the United Nations General Assembly, he spoke about the Global Thailand that this will be a very important vehicle for Qatar in the future.